That's actually a great question. Uh, so there are a variety of patterns to doing this problem. So the first thing you have to think about in any kind of retrieval augmented generation app is you only know what's in your knowledge base. In this case, your knowledge base as your cognitive search. Uh, if you don't have documents in it that answer your questions, uh, in our demo, we actually, uh, if I switch back to the code here, uh, we actually have kind of set up our prompt so that we want to give up rather than give an incorrect answer. Why, why would we do that? Right. So I think when it comes to uh, when it comes to chat your data applications, a lot of the customization can actually happen completely in natural language, like no coding required. We actually tell it in natural language, don't cite stuff you don't you don't have access to. So this is a common problem in language models. It's called hallucination. Uh, and basically a way to mitigate that hallucination is to combine grounding context from this knowledge source. In this case, like, hey, I retrieved documents relevant to my query and I gave it instructions in natural language to say, only use the sources that are, are present in the prompt I gave you.